Morning, we've just parked up in Hartsop where we're going to do a circular round of Brock Crags and Angletown Pikes. Today it's me, Essex Go in the Wild, and Billy's up there through the gate, avoiding the cattle grid, which he hates. <laughs> so, right in front of us, there we've got Great Crag, the Valley of Pastures Bottom. Above that, we've got Raven Crag, and just to the right of us, slightly behind us now, we've got Hartsop Dodd. That's Hayes Water Gill below us in the pump house. We're not heading that way today. We're going to carry on up this track and a little further up here we're going to dog leg back on a traverse path which will take us up to Brock Crags. So yeah, just before the filter house we're going to head up the bank here and onto this traverse path past this big boulder. Just a little further up here, the path's going to take a right and it's going to head up that way, steeply in the direction of Brock Crags. Here we are, take a right just by this big boulder here and head up towards the crags. Down below Hartsop Dodd there, you can just see Brothers Water. There's Hayes Water to our right below the Norton Grey Crag and we shouldn't really be too far from Brock Crags now just up there to our left somewhere When you get to the hole in the wall Turn left 
and head up onto Brock Crags through this boggy bit. And over there to our right is Angletown and Angletown Pikes. The summit of Brock Crags, 561 metres to Wainwright and a Burkitt. And here's the rock star. Just going to wander over to this little pinnacle to the left of us for a view and then we'll come back. So we've just dropped off the backside of Brock Crags up there. We had a while wander about and explored the crags a bit. And we've dropped down this path to the wall here. We're going to cross through the wall and we're going to head for Angletown Pike. To our left, closest to us is High Top Above Howe. Behind that we've got Fairfield dropping down to St Sunders Crag. And behind Sensitive's Crag in the distance you've got Helvellyn and Cat's Eye Cam, Helvellyn's in the Clag. So is Fairfield. So there's Angletown Pikes up there above us. We have a slight problem first, where the wall's broken here. We've got to get across the outflow from the town. I think I'm going to go and find an easier way. Stand, in, stand on the middle one. I'm trying to get to the middle, that's what I'm trying to do. There, and then you can step straight across from that one. You can. Anyhow, we managed. <laughs> There's a path. There, look. <laughs> Going up Tangle Town Pikes. That there, I would imagine, is usually shallow. Yeah. So that's just back on a decent path, and we're going to head up there somewhere where Trace is at. There's another path that takes us up onto the south summit and then onto the Wainwright summit of Angletown Pikes. 
so we just left that path just about here there's a little cairn you'll see it and a fern path heading straight up the hill to the south summit there you go the path zigzags up the front of the south top to the summit 565 meters I'm going to drop along the ridge and then there should be a path taking us off the front of the south summit heading for the Wainwright summit just down here We'll avoid that horrendous looking bog in the bottom and we'll keep tucked up to the side of this crag here and we'll meet Tracy over there on the footpath Cross through the col between the two summits and then head up onto Wainwright Summit So here we are Angletown Pikes Wainwright Summit or the North Top 567 meters so it's only two meters higher than the south top which is over there behind us now we're going to drop right off the front of the ridge there's a footpath off it down the crag at the front in the direction of brothers water over there in front of us to get down onto that path and then back down into the valley There's the end of Hull's Water and place fell in front of us. I think our man Dave Hostel, mountain man's on there today. We're going to drop down this path back into Hartsop. We're heading for the Bordale Hawes, which is the junction of paths below Place Fell. So this is the Bordale Hawes here. The sheepfold there just to our left. We're going to take the path down this way. So from the Hawes here, this path straight in front of me to our right would take us down into Patterdale and the lake shore but this path here where Tracy and Billy is will take us back round to Hartsop
path runs all the way down in the direction of Brothers Water where it eventually hits the road and back up to the car park in Artsop We're just going to nip up here and have a look at Angleton Beck Waterfall So I'm going to wrap my video up here now by the time we get into Hartsop the walk will have been about six and a half miles so I hope you enjoyed it if you like the content please think about giving us a subscribe myself and Tracy Essex girl in the wild <laughs> I'll keep filming until we get back but for now I'll see you next time bye and there he is up ahead as usual Billy boy! <laughs> <laughs>from the car park above the village of Artsop we took the track down Hayeswater Gill where we doubled back on ourselves at the filter house and head for the summit of Brock Crags after exploring Brock Crags summit we dropped down to Angleton and from Angleton we head up to Angleton Pikes south summit back down into the Col and then over the north summit from the north summit we drop down to the Bordale Hawes and then back down the Traverse Path taking a visit to Angleton Beck's Waterfall we then drop back down into Hartsop. <laughs>